Hear now a reading from Jesus and the Disinherited by Howard Thurman. What, then, is the work of the religion of Jesus to those who stand with their backs to the wall? There must be the clearest possible understanding of the anatomy of the issues facing them. They must recognize fear, deception, hatred, each for what it is. Once having done this, they must learn how to destroy these or to render themselves immune to their domination. In so great an undertaking, it will become clear that the contradictions of life are not ultimate. The disinherited will know for themselves that there is a spirit at work in life and in the hearts of humans which is committed to overcoming the world. It is universal, knowing no age, no race, no culture, and no condition of humans. For the privileged and underprivileged alike, if the individual puts at the disposal of the spirit the needful dedication and discipline, they can live effectively in the chaos of the present, the high destiny of a child of God. Here ends the reading. When they were approaching Jerusalem at Bethpage and Bethany near the Mount of Olives, he sent two of his disciples and said to them, Go into the village ahead of you, and immediately as you enter it, you will find tied there a colt that has never been ridden before. Untie it and bring it. If anyone says to you, why are you doing this? Just say, the Lord needs it, and we'll send it back immediately. They went away and found a colt tied near a door outside the street. As they were untying it, some of the bystanders said to them, What are you doing untying the colt? They told them what Jesus had said, and they allowed them then to take it after all. Then they brought the colt to Jesus and threw their cloaks upon it, and he sat on it. Many people spread their cloaks on the, on the road, and others spread leafy branches that they had cut in the fields. Then those who went ahead and those who followed were shouting, 
Hosanna. Blessed is the one who comes in the name of the Lord. Blessed is the coming kingdom of our ancestor David. Hosanna in the highest heaven. Then he entered Jerusalem and went into the temple. And when he had looked around at everything, as it was already late, he went out to Bethany with the twelve. 